Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for July 21st of 2023. Well, it is titled Galactic Cirrus Mandel Wilson 9. So what do we see here? Well, this is what we call the galactic cirrus. And they're called that likely for the resemblance to cirrus clouds, very thin, wispy clouds in Earth's upper atmosphere. However, these are within our galaxy and actually toward the poles of our galaxy. So they are several hundred light years up above the plane of the galaxy, which contains the vast majority of the stars, the gas and the dust in our galaxy. So up above it, we do get this thin, uh, the thin layer of dusty material that actually kind of looks a little bit red, not necessarily in this image, but it also gives a little reddish glow, which is occurs when the dust grains that make this up take ultraviolet radiation from all of the stars that strike that area and then convert them into a visible light and it happens to come out visible in the red portion of the spectrum. Now we see this it's just a very interesting uh, combination of things. And it can cause issues when you're taking images of things that happen to be in the direction of this galactic cirrus. Now it happens to be located near the poles of our galaxy. So towards the north and south galactic poles. So if you're trying to look at galaxies that happen to be through this, it can then give you issues because you're going to see extra material there that you might associate with the galaxy, whereas it is really a associated with our galaxy. So it could cause some confusion in terms of interacting galaxies and what we see as an interacting galaxy, because we may be seeing some of the material that we think is at the great distance of these galaxies that are interacting. And we may be seeing that with, that's actually cirrus within our own galaxy. And that's especially true when we take very deep long exposures in the directions of the galactic poles. Now within the image itself, we see stars, those stars are within our Milky Way galaxy. So pretty much everything you're seeing here is within the Milky Way, except for the other galaxies that you see scattered around. And if you look around, you'll see a few objects that are not stars. And sometimes you'll see that telltale shape of a spiral or disk galaxy. And as you look around the image, you can see several of those scattered over this area. And those are other galaxies at great distances, which happen to be located well beyond the galactic cirrus that we're looking at today. So that was our picture of the day for July 21st of 2023. It was titled Galactic Cirrus Mandel Wilson 9. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.